Hello everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how you can add or remove data fields and categories using the Flex system. To find the Flex system, go to WPL, select Flex, and once the page loads, you'll see the category management first. The category management menu allows you to edit the name of the category, trash the category and all the fields that are within it, enable or disable the category, and move it around like so. Let's go to the basic details category. This category has plenty of fields already in it. You can make a field mandatory. This means that an agent won't be able to post a listing until this field has some kind of value in it. You can trash the field, enable or disable it, add to available sort options, or remove from sort options and you can move it around just like the categories. This cog is for customization purposes. And here is where you edit the settings of the field. You can select which data category this field belongs to. You can edit the name of this field. The text search option, yes and no, it indicates that if it's yes, this field can be looked up on search. And if no, this field will not be able to be looked up on search. The detail page search widget PDF flyer allows you to show and hide this field. So if you select show, this field will be shown on the detail page or search widget or PDF flyer. Network apply is specifically for the franchise add-on. And if select is yes, the change to the field will be reflected throughout the network. You can select a field to be specific to a condition. So it can be listing specific, property type specific, or field specific. And here, if a value is empty or zero, you can select if to show it, to hide it, or for it to show a text. If we were to add a new select field, you can choose the select options, select one, select two, select three. As you can see, our new field select is at the bottom of the menu. And if we reload, our add listing menu, we can find that the select field is at the very bottom. Select one, two, three.